here we can see that this is incident ray this is refracted ray and this one is emergent ray all these three are same line because this is the condition of normal incidence where this glass surface is making 90 degree angle with the incident ray but the angle of incidence will be 0 degree because incident ray and normal are in the same side and that's why there is no deviation no change in the path lateral displacement is also zero there is no change in the direction of the light ray but if i increase the angle of incidence we can see that this refracted ray is shifted towards right hand side if i increase the angle more the lateral shift is more and the incident ray and refracted ray here to come out these two are parallel and this parallel distance between two is called lateral displacement and it is increasing if i increase the angle of incidence you can see this is increasing if i shift it to the left hand side it goes to the left hand side and also increases when i increase the angle of incidence so i can say that lateral displacement is directly proportional to the angle of incidence in this case i have placed the glass slab in vertical position and the light ray is passing only through this portion but when i placed it in this side the light ray has to travel comparatively a longer path okay so light ray is traveling more distance through the glass and that's why lateral shift b should be more let's check this here this is the light ray which is coming through the glass and this is a light ray which is emergent and when i change the angle here the lateral shift is comparatively more we can see that there is a huge difference and similarly that side also it means the thickness of the glass slab also is directly proportional to the lateral shift and the third factor on which it depends is the material like if rather than a glass if i take diamond or some other material the lateral shift will increase so there are three factors one is thickness of the glass slab second is angle of incidence and third is refractive index which will change the lateral shift